Good morning. Thought we'd do something a little bit different today. I just woke up. Got to go to work today. First things first, we got to get the coffee. All right, we're on the BMX. Got my Tim's on, laces out. And uh, let's throw the chest cam on for a bit, I think. And hit up this skate park. Shouldn't be too many people there this time of day. And I got like 10 extra minutes. Hey, bud. It. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. <laughs> I'm cutting it very close. It's uh seven forty. I think I actually have like only four minutes to get a clip here. It's only one person here, this is awesome. Still there? Yeah. Having the same problem with my throat. Oh yeah. Yeah. This is like morning. Like all gooey. Yeah. So I just got down to this uh, studio, and there's really no one here yet. So. I'm, uh, Go to the water really quick. It's, you know, my favorite place to be. Damn, there's people swimming across the river. This is crazy. Check this out. This is nuts. Damn, they're swimming in the river. Look at these guys, the champions. <laughs> so I guess that's a regular thing for those guys. That's so strange. I see so much weird stuff in New York. A lot of construction, but yeah. Check out this breakfast, it looks really good. It's like some quiche and uh, muffins. It's pretty sick. This catering's mad good, look at this. They got like some pomegranate berries going on in here so nice looking these guys are just doing laps back and forth i've been watching them oh, clothing change good how's it going good morning i'm good this is the craft service section got a nespresso Mots, chips. Look at this. Look at this. Just taking a quick Pringle break. It's freaking dark on that set, man. Need a mask break too, but it's going well. We're ahead of schedule. Almost lunch. Should be good. We we'll go back to the water. Woo. Last lunch broke about uh, 20 minutes early. 
it's pretty much as ideal as the day can go. They even got Coca-Colas today. It's my uh, little bad drink that I like to drink sometimes. We got some nice stuff going on over here at the water. Got the Statue of Liberty, I mean the uh, Empire State Building over there. Uh, yeah, pretty cool area, right? This is where I go eat lunch when I work on this film shoot. I've been working on this film shoot for almost three years. They fly the, the airplanes and take off and land over here. So I like to sit on this bench. I hang out with other crew members too, but I don't want to put them on my YouTube channel. But yeah, it's a cool spot. You can sit here and um, watch the airplanes because they have like a little... Uh, you can see the helicopter there, but they got like a little like takeoff helipads over here. And they also do seaplanes. So I like to watch the seaplanes and uh, you know, the ferry and uh, yeah, it's just really cool. That was a long day. I'm pretty beat up, brain dead and exhausted. But yeah, that's work for you. So yeah, go home. I think that the walk that I bought is in the mail. I bought a walk. That should be cool. I really wanted to uh, get a nice thing to cook with. All I have is that jet boil thing and I don't really think it's too healthy to be eating the non-stick all the time. So, gotta walk. I'm pumped. It's a uh, babish, babish, babish. Yeah, I'm gonna cook up some porgies for dinner. Look at this babish, John. Oh, bless you. He's sneezing over here. God bless you. Bless you, bless you, bless you, bless you. It's cooled down a bit, so I guess you're supposed to dump a tiny bit of that in there. And then give it an even coat to season it. Yeah, so you can see that's the smoke we're looking for. So I think I just gotta turn that off, get it off the heat, and uh, we should be good to go once this burns off. Add a little more oil and it's porgy time. This area is where I've been prepping all my fishing stuff. I finally organized a lot of my tackle. This is all tackle. And then I've got like almost double this in another spot. Yeah, I put like the rods I'm using over here, usually like two or three. A lot of these rods are functional. I've got like a whole closet full. I think there's like eight over here that are all totally good. And then I got two in here. And yeah, like another nine functional setups. Another next to my kayak. Um, yeah, basically I roll out with one of these bags every time I go fishing and load it up right here is where my brain kind of organizes things. I've got gold, you know, there's like tons of stuff. Like, yeah, brother gave this to me for my birthday. Still haven't whipped this out, but I'm looking forward to that. Yeah, just like tons of stuff, man. But yeah, this is how my, my brain works. Just got tackle upon tackle, reels everywhere, needle fish, and then I grabbed this down. These are all like functional reels. I threw a bunch of stuff away recently, but these are all good. Uh, this is a reel, this is a Daiwa I used to use. This is a Shimano 2K I used to use. I caught, dude, one day I caught, I'm not even kidding you, like 23 straight striped bass with this reel. This, this one I got like a year ago, Sedona 500. It's kind of trash, honestly. The Tatula, I made a video about this like three years ago when uh, I went to Bernie's and um, bought this from them. And I got a bait caster lesson for the first time. That was cool. I actually broke this reel. Oh, well, it's like kind of broken. The Like the shaft thing got bent out with a big striper when I was in Jamaica Bay. Yeah, 5K reel, 
Uh, Pen Fathom. Yeah, just a bunch of stuff. This is how this is how my brain works here. And believe it or not, I've got about double, double this tackle. Uh, Ron Z gave this to me. Uh, a Z fin paddle tail is pretty dope. Haven't caught anything with that yet, but we will. Thought it'd be cool to show you what one of these edits looks like because I haven't really dug into this yet. Um, I started editing like the intro bit and uh, you know, this is an upcoming video just to kind of show you the amount of work that goes into these videos. This is, you know, I think that's like six and a half hours of footage and this video right here will probably be, I want to guess, eight minutes long something like that and this is pretty you know this is pretty typical um so you can see you know i'm not catching fish the whole time there's a lot of a lot of dead casts here a lot of moving around and uh i think this is two days two days of shooting and it'll probably be one eight to the Probably not even, it'll probably be like six minutes, like, you know, pretty fast paced, but yeah, I just wanted to show you that just to, it's a lot of work. Um, a lot of times that's, you know, there's just, it just takes so much time to sift through this footage that, uh, yeah, that's one thing I don't think people really, really realize with these videos, you know, it's all, it's a passion project. So yeah, let's get to cooking. These are some cool relics that I have. This is the Penn Long Beach from my grandpa. Uh, and the uh, Shakespeare Wondercast. <laughs> so cool. This reel is totally functional. Uh, so beautiful. Isn't that a beautiful reel? First time using the walk. I'm excited. I'm ex excited to do this. Ooh. The fish does smell a little fishy, not gonna lie. It'll be fine. The fish tastes fine, it's just a little sketchy. But I bet you these dumplings are gonna be bomb. Yeah, it's still sticking a little bit, like I can feel it in the pan. Or I don't know. That's what I'm talking about. Ooh, those look good. A little burnt, but that's my fault. Ooh, this is exciting. These look good. Ooh, these look good. Even if they are a little well done, it's fine. Yeah, let me know what you think about my, my walk here. And nice watermelon. No, but um, I feel like the, the, the YouTube thing kind of paints me as a pretty one-dimensional character and it's, I don't know, it's just not me, so want to do something a little bit different show you what I do for a living you know, head out to Manhattan eat some lunch eat some dinner open up some new tools show you my tackle I don't know. let me know what you think let me know if you like these videos it's kind of nice not to catch a fish for a video yeah see you on the next one thanks for joining me